Hi, I want to invite you to spend the next few minutes with me in God's presence and in God's Word. We need both His presence and His Word in order to experience the fullness of His joy and peace in our lives. First, let's prepare to experience His presence. Find a comfortable, relaxing posture, and this could be sitting, kneeling, reclining, or lying down. Let's do a quick body check from head to toe. Let's start by relaxing any tension in your forehead. Let go of any wrinkles or creases. Now, let's relax your face. Let your jaw release. Feel the weight of your chin dropping slightly. Relax your neck. Relax your shoulders. Relax your arms. Relax your hands. Wiggle your fingers. Allow your stomach to unwind and let go of any knots or tension. Feel your hip joints loosening and uncoiling. Your thighs are freeing up from tension and they're feeling light and easy. Feel your calf muscles unwinding. Even your heels are now free from tension, feeling light and easy. And finally, wiggle your toes. Now, let's take three deep breaths. We're going to inhale, hold, and then exhale. Let's go. Inhale. Hold. Exhale. Inhale. Hold. Exhale. Inhale, hold, exhale. Now that we're relaxed, let's invite the Lord into this moment with us. Heavenly Father, thank you for your presence in our lives and thank you for being with us in this moment. As we spend time with you in your word, I pray that we will experience your peace in ways that we never have before. Do only what you can do in moments like these. And I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Mark 6, 31. Jesus said to them, Come with me by yourselves to a quiet place and get some rest. Matthew 11, 28 through 30. Come to me, all of you who are weary and carry heavy burdens, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you. Let me teach you, because I am humble and gentle at heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy to bear, and the burden I give you is light. Jeremiah 6, 16. This is what the Lord says. Stand at the crossroads and look. Ask for the ancient paths. Ask where the good way is and walk in it and you will find rest for your souls. Psalm 37 7. Be still in the presence of the Lord and wait patiently for Him. Psalm 4, 8. In peace I will lie down and sleep, for you alone, O Lord, will keep me safe. Psalm 91, 
1 through 7. Those who live in the shelter of the Most High will find rest in the shadow of the Almighty. This I declare about the Lord. He alone is my refuge, my place of safety. He is my God, and I trust him. For he will rescue you from every trap and protect you from deadly disease. He will cover you with his feathers. He will shelter you with his wings, and his faithful promises are your armor and protection. Do not be afraid of the terrors of the night, nor the arrow that flies in the day. Do not dread the disease that stalks in darkness, nor the disaster that strikes at midday. Though a thousand fall at your side, and though ten thousand are dying around you, these evils will not touch you. Just open your eyes and see how the wicked are punished. If you make the Lord your refuge, if you make the Most High your shelter, no evil will conquer you. No plague will come near your home. For he will order his angels to protect you wherever you go. They will hold you up with their hands so you won't even hurt your foot on a stone. You will trample upon lions and cobras. You will crush fierce lions and serpents under your feet. The Lord says, I will rescue those who love me. I will protect those who trust in my name. When they call on me, I will answer. I will be with them in trouble. I will rescue and honor them. I will reward them with a long life and give them my salvation. Psalm 121, 1 through 8. I look up to the mountains. Does my help come from there? My help comes from the Lord who made heaven and earth. He will not let you stumble. The one who watches over you will not slumber. Indeed, he who watches over Israel never slumbers or sleeps. The Lord himself watches over you. The Lord stands beside you as your protective shade. The sun will not harm you by day, nor the moon at night. The Lord keeps you from all harm and watches over your life. The Lord keeps watch over you as you come and go, both now and forever. Psalm 23 The Lord is my shepherd. I have all that I need. He lets me rest in green meadows. He leads me beside peaceful streams. He renews my strength. He guides me along right paths bringing honor to his name. Even when I walk through the darkest valley, I will not be afraid, for you are close beside me. Your rod and your staff protect and comfort me. You prepare a feast for me in the presence of my enemies. You honor me by anointing my head with oil. My cup overflows with blessings. Surely, your goodness and unfailing love will pursue me all the days of my life, and I will live in the house of the Lord forever. Proverbs 3, 5 through 6. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways submit to Him, and He will make your paths straight. Isaiah 26, 3. You will keep in perfect peace all who trust in you, all whose thoughts are fixed on you. Psalm 16, 7 through 9. I will bless the Lord who guides me. Even at night, my heart instructs me. I know the Lord is always with me. I will not be shaken, for he is right beside me. No wonder my heart is glad and I rejoice. My body rests in safety. Deuteronomy 31, 8 
the Lord himself goes before you and will be with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. Psalm 3, 3 through 6. But you, O Lord, are a shield around me. You are my glory, the one who holds my head high. I cried out to the Lord, and he answered me from his holy mountain. I lay down and slept, yet I woke up in safety, for the Lord was watching over me. I am not afraid of 10,000 enemies who surround me on every side. Zephaniah 3, 17 The Lord is with you, the mighty warrior who saves. He will take great delight in you. In his love, he will no longer rebuke you, but will rejoice over you with singing. John 14, 27 I am leaving you with a gift, peace of mind and heart. And the peace I give is a gift the world cannot give. So don't be troubled or afraid. Philippians 4, 6 through 7. Don't worry about anything. Instead, pray about everything. Tell God what you need and thank him for all he has done. Then you will experience God's peace which exceeds anything we can understand. His peace will guard your hearts and minds as you live in Christ Jesus. Romans 15, 13 I pray that God, the source of hope, will fill you completely with joy and peace because you trust in Him. 1 Peter 5 7. Give all your worries and cares to God, for He cares about you. Isaiah 30, 15. Only in returning to me and resting in me will you be saved. In quietness and confidence is your strength. Proverbs 3, 24. You can go to bed without fear. You will lie down and sleep soundly. I pray that this has been a special time for you in God's presence and in God's word. Rest well.